Hi boners, I'm Carvine and this is my first video tutorial. I just do a uh, basic suspension. This will be the finished project, or I'm sorry, product. Just a uh, basic thruster steering, elastic. I'll tell you the uh, advanced ball socket settings, all that shit. So here are your basic components. We have the spindles, the base, and the steering master. This here will guide the front two spindles and uh, steer it. So we'll start out by weighting it. Let's make this base 600 kilograms. Make the spindles uh, 200. And the uh, steering master about 300. And we'll take some uh, easy precision, place them on the frame. Simple enough. And then we'll space them out. About 600 nudge, whatever. And then we'll push them down. About 50 nudge. This will be the max extension of the suspension. And then we'll attach the steering master with axis to the center. Thanks, Gmod. Let's fuck up. Oh, okay, there we go. Okay, now we'll do the uh, advanced ball sockets. So I'll go to advanced ball sockets. We'll be doing it for the steering master. Set uh, X to 0, Y is 0, and Z minimum to negative 45, Z maximum to 45. Check free movement and no collide. Click the steering master and then the frame. What this will do is it'll keep the uh, Steering master limited, so we only turn 45 degrees. And then for the uh, rear spindles to keep them in line, just set everything to zero. And then click the spindle in the frame, spindle, frame. And then for the front ones, we click the spindle and then the steering master. Spindle, steering master. Okay, next we'll uh, attach some ropes. That will be the A arms for the suspension. Make sure it is a rigid rope. It's very critical that you, uh, the smart snap, click the top center and bottom center of the spindle to the frame. We'll do this for uh, all four spindles. What we'll do from there would be like a ball socket on each end so that uh, the spindle can spin freely on it. At the same time, the triangle keeps the spindle from moving back and forth. And the advanced ball socket keeps it from flopping. This is called a A-arm, double wishbone independent suspension. You can do it with one, but it uh, needs a lot of advanced ball sockets to keep it in line. It's a rather rough ride. This has proven to be the one of the most stable and smooth rides. We've got that. We'll apply another rope, this time not rigid, from the base of the spindle to the top of the frame for each spindle. What this will do is it will uh, make sure that the spindles do not expand any farther than this, which will cause your wheels to fuck up. All that shit or cause unnecessary body roll. So uh, then from here we'll start the elastic. Let's try 50,000 constant and 1,500 for both damping. Click the bottom of the spindle to the top just like the rope for each spindle. And by the way these settings I'm using for weights and everything are just dependent on this build alone. Whatever you do on your own you have to experiment and find out what works. And then uh, we'll make the uh, elastic to keep the the steering master centered. Let's try 20,000, 600 for both damping. This might be too much. I might limit the steering, but whatever. Click the bottom snap to the center of the frame like that for uh, both ends. 
Okay, and then we'll place some thrusters for steering. I recommend hydraulics, but this is just quicker. Set it to 600 or so. Four and six keys, whatever you want to do. These wire thrusters, whatever. So it's like that, so it'll spin. Okay, let's see, we got advanced box sockets, elastics. We just need some wheels. Some wheels in the center. Make sure they're all good to go here. Make sure I got all the weights. And now it should work. Let's find out. And look at that. It works. Oh dear, that seems like I fucked up the advanced ball socket. Press R on it. See what it's doing. So we clear the advanced ball sockets. Just ignore this part and let me fix it. See what I did wrong now. You need advanced ball sockets. When I told you to uh, for the steering master, you wanted the uh, negative 0.1, 0.1 for x, negative 0.1 for y, and 0.1, and then for z minimum negative 45, positive 45. And uh, click the mass steering master in the frame. No, it works. And this is Gibbo's mech. He is a faggot. A colossal fucking faggot.